Next time, I'm going to discuss what the try and method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main function. Here after that, go inside. So right here, I've taken double data type variable. First is n. Next, bin. Here after f1. f2. f3. So right here f1 initialized to 0, 0.0 and f3 0 0.3 oh sorry 0 0.1 here after x x1 so x1 initialized to 0 here after fact so fact initialized to 1 Next, frame. Or temp. And next, i. Here after control comes to print a function. So whatever I double code that is printed to the output screen. Enter fractional decimal number. And whatever I am going to enter, so that is by n. So I am going to enter n value 4.4. And percent %lf because uh, n is double data time. So here after control comes to this point. So n value go to x. So x is integer time. So n value is now 4.4. So 4.4 go to x. Then because of x is integer time. So x receive 4. Here after f2 equal to n minus x. So f2 is uh, double data time. So at uh, n value is now 4. 4.4 and x value is now 4. So at your f2 is now 0.4. 4.4 minus 4. The value comes 0.4. So f2 is now 0.4. And here after control comes to this point. So while x not equal to 0, 4 not equal to 0, condition is true, that coincides. So at your dream equal to x mod 2. So x value is now 4, 4 mod 2, remainder comes 0. So dream is now 0. And x, x1 equal to x1 plus dream into fact. So x1 value is now x1, x1 initialized to 0. And here 0 plus rim into fact. So rim value is now or 0 into 1. So x1 is now 0, no any changes. So x1 equal to x1 by 2. So 4 by 2, the value comes 2. Here after fact equal to fact into 10. So fact is now in its size to 1, 1 into 2, 10, the value comes 10. Here after loop continue, so that check x not equal to 0, so 2 not equal to 0, condition is to that coincide, dream equal to x mod 2. So x value is now 2, 2 mod 2, remainder comes 0, so dream is 0 now. And here x equal to x1 plus dream into fact. So at here x1 value is 0 and dream value is 0 and fact 10. So the overall the value comes 0. So x value is 0, no any changes. x equal to x by 2. So 2 by 2, the value comes 1. Here after fact equal to fact into 10. So this is now 100. Here after that go, check the condition 1 not equal to 0. The condition is so or true. So that coincide rim equal to x more 2. So x value is now 1, 1 more 2, rim is now 1. And here after x equal to x1 plus dream into facts. So x1 value is now 0 and dream value is now 1. 1 into a fact value is 100. So overall x1 become 100. Now here after x equal to x by 2. So x value is now 1, 1 by 2. The value comes 0. Here after fact equal to fact into 10. So fact is now 1000. Here after that go, check the condition 0 not equal to 0, condition is not true. So that not coincide, here after control comes to this point. Here after for loop, so at your i value start from 1. 
and all check the condition one less than six condition is to that coincides so at f2 equal to f2 into 2 so f2 value is now 0 0.4 so into 2 so the value comes 0 0.8 So at a F2 value go to 10. So F2 value is now 0 0.8. So that go to 10. Since the uh, temp is integer time, so at your uh, time value is now come 0. Now here after F1 equal to F1 plus F3 into time. So F1 value is now 0 and time value also 0. So 0 plus 0, F1 is now 0. Here after if time double equal to 1, so time value is now 0, condition is not to not coincide. Here f3 equal to f3 plus f3 by 10. So at here 0 point f3 become 0, 1. And now here after that go up, increase the value of i. So i is now 2. Or check the condition 2 less than 6, condition is to that coincide. So at here f3, so f2 equal to f2 into or 2. So at here, f2 value is now 0 0.8. 0 0.8 into 2, the value comes 1.6. So here after f2 value go to tam. So 1.6 value go to tam. So this receive only integer. So now tam is now 1. Here after f1 equal to f1 plus f3 into tam. So f1 value is now 0. f1 value is 0 plus f3. So f3 value is now 0 0.01 and tam value is 1. So at here f1 becomes 0 0.01. And hereafter, if time double equal to 1, so time value is 1 now. At here, f2 equal to f2 minus time. So f2 value is now 1.6. And time value is now, f2 value is so 1.6. And time value is 1. So this becomes 0 0.6. Now here after f3 equal to f3 a by 10. So this becomes 0 0.0 0 0 1. And here after that curve increase the value of i. So i is now 3. Check the condition 3 less than 6 condition is to that coincide. So at f2 equal to f2 into 2. So 0.6 into 2. So this becomes 1.2. Now here after f2 value go to time, so 1.2 we will go to time, so this receive 1 because time is integer time. Here after f1 equal to f1 plus f3 into time. So f1 value is now 0 0.01 plus f3. So f3 value is now 0. 0, 0, 1. So 0 0.001 into 1. So this value is now 0 0.001. So add here, let's add 0 0.010. 0. So add here 0 0.001. So at here, 1, 1, 0, point 0. So at here, f1 become 0, point 0, 1, 1. Now here after, if time double equal to 1, so time value is 1 now. So f2 equal to f2 minus time. So f2 value is now 1.2 minus 1. So is this become point 0.2. And here after f3 equal to f3 by 10. So this become 
zero point triple zero one. Now here after that curve increase the value of i. So i is for now. Check the condition for less than six. Condition is to that coincide. So f two equal to f twenty two. So point two. Point two into two. So the value come point four. Here after f two value equal to time. So point four. Then that is equal zero. Time value is now become zero. Point four converting to integer. So that become zero. Here after f one. Equal to f1 plus f3 into tam. So tam value is not zero. F1 value. So no any changes. F1 become 0.011. Here after. Here after that check if tam double equal to one. So tam value zero now. Condition is not true. So not coincide here. F3 equal to f3 by. So that add one zero. And here after that increase the value of i. So i is now five. Check the condition five less than six. Condition is to that coincide. So at the time f two equal to f twenty two. So at a point four into two. So that become point eight. And here after f two value equal to time. So this again that become zero. So at a f one equal to f one plus f three. So time value is zero. So this value is zero now. So that f one value equal to time. So no any changes. F1 value equal to F1, so no any changes here after. If time double equal to one, so time value is now zero, so not condition is not true. So at F3 equal to F3 by 10, so at that add one by zero. And here after that curve increase the value of i, so i is now six. See the condition six less than six condition is true that coincides. So at F2 equal to F22, so this become 1.6. And here after f2 value equal to time, so 1.6 convert into integer, so f time become one. And now at here f1 equal to f1 plus f3 into time, so f1 value is now this all. And here one into time, so time uh, f3, so f3 value is now this all. So this value is now this all. So if you are going to add, so the value come zero point zero one one zero 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 whatever and here zero point. Two, three, five, zero. Five, zero, and one. So the value is one, zero, zero, one, one, zero. Point. And now. Here after if time double equal to one, so time value is one now. So at here f two equal to f two minus time. So f two value is now one point six. So time value is here f two is now become point six. So at here f three equal to f three by ten. So that at one more zero. And now. Here after that curve, so i becomes seven. Check the condition. Seven less than six. Condition is not true. Not coincide. Here after b equal to x one plus f three f one. So x one value is now one double zero. So that add this value zero point one one zero zero one. So the output come one zero zero point zero one one zero zero one. And here, printer function equivalent binary number value. So percent time becomes bin is double time. So the output come this one double zero zero point uh, point zero one one zero zero one. And here after 
that all from main function so this is the trend method of this program so i hope guys you understand so thanks for watching see you next week